Lewis, first of all, welcome to Stoke City. How does it feel to be here? Yeah, thank you. I'm um, really excited. You know, it was a good start for me to come in. Three points. And yeah, that's what it was about. So, all in all, that was a real nice entrance. You'd obviously had a long association with Chelsea, but do you feel now you're ready to settle permanently at a different club? Yeah, obviously that was one of the main things for me. You know, it's uh, fantastic being associated for such a long time with the club and stuff, but I think for me personally, time for somewhere to settle down, go home and get going from there. You had a few options in terms of clubs, so what was it about Stoke City that, decided, that made the decision to come here? I spoke to the manager, you know, the staff, through um, a few conversations and that, and the project that they have going forward, you know, is something that I'm aligned with, you know, and uh, they're very ambitious and want get, to get back to the big time. So hopefully we can do that all together. Has it been somewhat of a whirlwind last few days, signing, training, and then playing against Cork? Yeah, yeah, but uh, very enjoyable as well, you know, coming, waiting for the, you know, the papers and stuff to sign, then training meeting all the lads and stuff, then going to the game, winning the game. So no, it was, it was great. I really had time to stop, you know, take it in at the moment, but no, I'm just happy to be here and yeah, it's a good start. In that short time that you're on the pitch, did we see a glimpse of what you'll bring to the team? Yeah, I hope so. I hope so. You know, I'm, I'm uh, very much so a team player. I want to win, want to win games, you know, whatever it takes and stuff. And uh, yeah, like I said, really excited to be here. What would you say your main attributes are as a midfielder? As a midfielder, you know, trying to dictate the game as much as possible, you know, break lines, keep keep possession of the ball, you know, with effectiveness, and uh, yeah, hopefully can contribute with some goals and assists as well. Hopefully, do you see yourself more as a defensive midfielder or a more advanced one, or a bit of both? Yeah, you know, I think as I've you know got older and got older and matured in my position and stuff, more so defensive but if the gaffer tells me to play in a certain position and you know, I'll do that for the team it's not a thing for me. You played regularly for Chelsea's under 23 this season so do you feel as though you're up to speed or do you think it might take a little bit of time? Yeah obviously I played some some games and stuff like that more so like the fitness the fitness side is is there you know obviously the, the tempos and stuff are going to be a bit different um, but no I feel like I'm in a good place at the moment and ready to get going. At 26, do you feel as though you're about to hit the prime as a midfielder? Yeah, you know, I still, I don't know everything, do you know what I mean? Um, but I feel like I'm in, a, I'm in a good situation, a place where I can develop as a player and, yeah, really get going. You've had various loan spells in the Championship before. Do you feel as though they'll help you to adapt to, to coming here? Yeah, I feel it's one of those ones as well where I have been on loan so many times. You know, it's not, you can take positives from that as well from different playing styles, different managers, you know, high press, low block, so many different aspects of how different coaches in that work. You can always take stuff from that also. So I think, you know, I'm very well-rounded in, you know, different kind of tactics and stuff like that. I suppose, having been at various clubs before, it doesn't daunt you coming into a new changing room? No, 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 no. You know, I've met a lot of people, met a lot of people on the way and, uh, yeah, hopefully now I can just sit, settle down, get to know people longer and stuff like that and, you know, go somewhere home and get going. We spoke to Sam Clippers on Sunday and he said it's one of the best changing rooms he's been in. Is that something you've felt since you've come into the club? Yeah, since I've been in, to be fair, everyone's been very welcoming and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? I've only been in a few days, so, you know, everything that I've experienced in the first few days has been great. You know, everyone's been very helpful. If I didn't know where this was or that was, you know, not ev everyone's open to asking stuff like that. So, very much appreciative. We've just passed the midway point in the season. From what you've seen in training and what you saw on Sunday, what do you feel as though this team's capable of doing this season? Yeah, great things, great things. You know, there's a lot of ambitious people around the club, and obviously having conversations in that as well. Um, we're not too far off them playoff places at the moment. And I think it's just one of them ones we've just got to keep pushing day in, day out, you know, to get the results when the match day comes.